What up, what up, what up? All right, guys, I'm gonna make another video here on Vroom ticker VRM. My last one on Vroom got way more views than I've ever got before. So if you guys are watching this for a second time, maybe leave a like or if you're not subscribed, subscribe to it. Um, if you guys get any type of knowledge out of this video, I'll try to keep it short and sweet. Uh, go ahead and leave a subscribe, all right? So Vroom here is one of the high, highest shorted stocks on the market right now. The short interest is on it is like 35 or 36%. Um, it's a small market cap, though. It's a $200 million market cap. But it's in a tight wedge uh, pennant uh, starting to form here, uh, getting real close to breakout any any hour now. So we're on the hour time frame, so every single candle represents one hour. So basically, since the earnings report here um, on May 10th, it's just been consolidating for just about a month now. We're getting really close to breakouts. Breakout move on the upside, we're going to get shorts cover their butts. Um, lots of shorts to cover. We could easily get a move up here real fast to the 3, 330 area. Somewhere in here, probably even 220 to 330. The way I'm playing this is with options. Um, options are extremely cheap on this right now. The problem is liquidity. So there's low volume on them. But if you can sneak in some buys here and there um, on tight spreads, um, you can get some good deals on options near and long term. Um, since this thing IPO'd four years ago, in case you guys don't know, it's just gotten absolutely destroyed. So this actually IPO'd up here around the $38 range. Push all the way up to 75, and then it's had an extreme meltdown like we've never seen before. This thing is just down, 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 down. But I think eventually here with so many shorts piled in, the, the, the risk-to-reward ratio on this is getting skewed to the upside now. And if this thing can break out as pennants, I think shorts, like I said, are going to cover their booty cheeks. And we're going to get a move up here to probably that 330 range. If not, after that, maybe even higher. Um, so we got a really good risk-to-reward right now on the options. Um, it's not like a, I mean, the company is losing money. They had a really good earnings report as well. Just to touch on the fundamentals real quick. They'd be on the top and bottom line. Um, and just, if you just look at the financials here, uh, let's go to the quarterly and just, I mean, they're growing, their they're growing their assets. They're growing their revenue, but they're burning cash and losing money. What I do like as well is that, uh, they're not diluting the shareholders like crazy. I mean, 130 million shares and up to 137 about two years later but the last couple of quarters has basically been the same so they're not they're not diluting the shareholders um they are burning cash um they're an e-commerce platform here on auto sales so just want to keep an eye on if you guys like this video uh go ahead and leave a like or subscribe all right peace